up, fam. Here's the latest Milwaukee pack out accessory. It's some kind of shelf that goes into E track. These brackets go into E track, which I've got in my trailer already. And they support the pack out mount. And apparently you can put up to 50 pounds on it once it's on there. So I'm gonna try to set up the drawers on there. And that way you can have it setting up and things can be underneath it. And it's out of the way. So these just slide in and then some screws go in the side. There are screw holes on the side. So that stiffens it up quite a lot. And then these just go into the E-track. And these are, they're calling these shoring screws. So once it's clipped in, I guess you tighten these and it prevents it from rattling around because I know E-track connectors can be kind of loose, kind of jiggly, floppy in that connection. So I'm gonna try putting that in and uh, see how it works. It's definitely flimsy, especially with that second box on top. It really moves around just empty, just asking to break it off. So I'm gonna use some straps just to snug it up, take some weight off, keep it held up against the trailer. That's a lot more secure. And I've got them loaded up, configured with the drills in there, a couple uh, M18 drills and some big bits. I've got the hacksaw in here. It's got some different wood blades for it, various metal blades in this container. The cordless angle grinder with some different discs in there. And of course, a recipe tool with different bits for that, different attachments coming in really handy for the last few jobs I've been doing. Jigsaw with a whole bunch of blades, extra saw blades, stapler, 16 gauge nailer with nails, 18 gauge nailers in the shop, but it could live in there if it fits in there. And then these things buckle up and prevent the drawers from sliding open when you drive. Works pretty slick. And it's a great use of space above the air compressor. That worked out so well, I've actually added a second one to the front. And it fits right on top where the vacuum is. It just works out that way with where the E-Track is located. I'm gonna shore this one down. That really snugs them down. That's a perfect spot for this bin.